increases. Yeah. The new? Uh, yeah, relatively. It's pretty loud. Are you shooting something right now? Yeah, I just, I just started recording. <laughs> it's fun. About energy dissipation. Yeah. Well, unhappiness. How'd the audition go? Uh, it was okay. I was too quiet. Mm. I was too calm. I, I have to heat up and let them see that and then immediately make myself cool and cold so that they want to see it again. Because when, you get them levels. Yeah, when, when if you can heat up, people watch it, people want to see it, and then if you can cool down, then they want to see it again. Mm -hmm. But I was cool the whole time. Mm -hmm. I didn't get excited. Yeah. Hi. How are you doing? Good. Doing my taxes. Uh -huh. I'm done, actually. Yes. Just getting ready to send them off. It's yes. fun. How have you been, though? Good. I just got back about a week ago. For good, or? Yeah. For a while. I have to go back to Atlanta to shoot another thing, but shot a couple movies. Were you, you in Atlanta all the time? Mm -mm, I was traveling all over, but I ended up in Atlanta most of the time. So, what? Me too. I like it a lot. My sister goes to Emory. Oh, okay. She's graduating, so I'm going to go back for her graduation as well. I made a deal with the producers to fly me back the weekend of her graduation. Dude. So, I'm going to shoot my scenes then. I spent a lot of time now. Yeah, I was just there. I was like, I was living in a homeless shelter, not homeless there, but here. My very first team was working. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a great place. You'd love it, Ian. It's very Kent. It's very Kentish. Oh, mm -hmm. is there a train system? It's like, it's very it's hippie, spread out as like, this, but there's more of a central downtown. And there's just so much to do there. It's, it's really. Atlanta's it's great. Chill. I would live, oh. my sister's moving, or I would stay, I would consider moving there. Is the weather, like, does it swell with It's heat? like Ohio, yeah. It is like Ohio without the snow. Yeah. Like, it this, doesn't get as cold, but it has the seasons change. Oh. It's, I mean, and it, it gets more humid. It's this year, maybe? Yeah. I'd say in the winter. It, it did snow while I was there once or yeah. twice. Yeah, like, an inch. And the whole town closes down, and they're like, on the news report, you know, we're from Ohio. <laughs> and they're like, oh, da 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 like, freaking out, like, before 11 o'clock today, this is what we saw. And they pan, and there's, like, a, a roller stuck in the ground, and it's, like, <laughs> five centimeters. They're, like, measuring five centimeters. Like, well, Bob, back to you. You know, it's like, summer. Simmer down. You can all drive and get to work. It's going to be all right. Just going to have to use that old defrost button. I remember the first or second year I was out here, there was a frost one night, the next morning, and we woke up, freaked out, and it's like, <coughs> really? It's just a little frost. And it was on college campus, like, you don't even have to go anywhere. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what are you freaking out about? <laughs> That's it. Uh, You're like, you might have to put your slippers on to walk across your room to get your bong. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, dude, I guess. Yeah, good Let's to see, see you. you. Be around a little bit, or? Actually, not doing much at all right now. I'm just um, hopefully auditioning and. Are you staying back here? Yeah. Cool, man. Yeah, come back. I'm going to go mail this. Okay. Get it. I got it. $554. Dude, nice. In your state? No. In addition to? <laughs> I owe like 200 to the state. You do? Yeah. Just do it. Just do it. It's easy to do online. I do it. You did the e file? Yeah. I get, I'm getting four fifty from the from federal and then I pay them to something. Mm -hmm. They last year they seized my return from my student loan. I hope they don't do that soon. They seized your O to pay them off. You didn't make are you not forbearing it? Deferring it? I wasn't. I was defaulted. Which I'm not now because I've been paying it was actually a year and a half ago. I've been paying about three hundred dollars a month for the last year and a half. Jeez. Yeah. Taking a chunk out of it. Which I'm done doing now. Now I'll be going into um, forbearance. <laughs> How much did you pay off? A lot. I mean, whatever 250 times 18 months is. 30, 44, 45. Except I think the student loan is pretty much the last one you pay off. Because <laughs> it's the easiest one, you know? So everything else will probably come first. Yes, the car and credit. Yeah. And then I walk in the best. I don't have any car loans. Awesome. Never have. I've always bought my car straight up. Yeah, Will's about to buy a house. Here? That's good. That's good. I'm excited for him. He wants to own a house. Yeah. It would be nice. God. I gotta buckle.
cool down, man. I gotta. I just gotta learn how to heat up and cool down properly. It'll be okay. Yeah, we should practice. Okay. Practice now. <laughs> All leading to this conversation, eh? Um, I feel like there's several words swimming in my head. Entropy. Oh, diffusion. That's a good one. I was thinking dissipation, but diffusion's a smaller word, a little more concise. Um, but the unhappiness is, is, uh, creates a state of entropy, a loss of energy, which allows the ch electric charge that's in the body to dissipate, to spread out, to just to sink away. Like if you're on a surfboard and you're surfing and you stop moving, you'll slowly sink in. That's what unhappiness is. It's a cooling mechanism for the body because... You lose it when you have it. If you're unhappy, you lose it. And that takes away that feeling, that swelling. Hey, Schmidt. That takes away that feeling of having it, of, of gaining, of, of the swelling. And both are important. Unhappiness, I put myself kind of in a state of unhappiness a large percentage of the time because... I found that if I'm happy too much, I've, well, I'm afraid that if I'm happy too much, the system will explode. If the system means my body, I don't know, probably, or something, if I'm happy all the time. So I'm unhappy, so I put happiness just out of reach. But not, I have it, I know what it is, I know what I want that will make me happy, and I, I choose to keep it just a, far enough away from me that I don't have it. But it's there, and I know I could have it. But I don't. I'm unhappy. I'm, it allows me to keep the heat equidistant away. I force it away, literally, with force, with, with want. I want things so that I keep them away. I force them away and then am unhappy. And that's the cycle. Now, the balance is understanding this, this concept so I can choose to be happy and then to be unhappy and be aware of when I'm doing both so I could, could navigate the system, swell and sink. The, like if, with auditions, for instance, they want to see activity, they want to see heat, but then, like they want, I went into an audition today and I was cool the whole time, I wasn't speaking, I was calm and it was a, it was a cool thing, but that's not inter interesting to people. They, they want to see heat and then, then they want to see cool as I'm leaving. So they, they know I can do both and then they br want to bring it back and see it again. They want to turn it on and turn it off. And I can do that. We can all do that. Really dissecting the concepts and looking at them point by point gives us an opportunity to. I should draw it out, put it on the board, put it on the board. So I've been unhappy. I, I think maybe because I was happy for so long. Happy, I was I was taking in a lot of attention from a specific, a specific woman, and it was causing a, a great deal of happiness. And since I, hey man, I've chosen to rest in a state of unhappiness. It's kind of nerve-wracking because I don't quite have what I want, but it's intentional, and it's a better. It's. Maybe it's time. Maybe I'm making this and recording these thoughts because it's time to grasp what I want for a time before I cool again. What do you think, Schmidt? You can come here and tell. How do you feel about this camera on you? I'll scratch you.
maneuver to a new location.